Hey guys, John here with Realtruck.com. Today I want to show you how to install the Husky Liner Universal Fit Molded Mud Flaps. Guys, you can see here, these come with everything you need to get these installed onto your truck. Comes with both your mud guards. And something to keep in mind is that these come for right and left, as you can see here. So if you're gonna be doing front and rear, then you wanna get yourself two sets. And also, if your vehicle does not have factory mud flaps on it already, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna to have to use the provided hardware that comes with it. And um, we'll show you guys how to use this stuff. So there you have it. Let's get these on the truck. Now the first thing that we're going to have to do here in order to install our mud guards on the front of our truck is to take our screws out of this factory piece that comes on here. So we're going to get those out and those are just a uh, Torx bit that you use to uh, pull those screws loose. So what we've done here guys is we've gone ahead and decided where we want to put our mud, our mud guard on here, how, uh, how high we want it off the ground and such. And so what we, we've done is we've went ahead and used these two factory holes here and uh, made our holes in our mud guard here to match up. So that way we can kind of keep it at a, at a decent height. And also we have our top hole drilled into our, into our mud guard. Now, on this particular vehicle, it, we're going to have to do something just a little bit different. Now, if your vehicle has an opening on the inside here and your fender and your inner fender lip is flat, then what you would do is you would drill a quarter inch hole for your top hole and then take the provided clips and slide those over from the inside across that hole and then use the provided screws that come with your mud guards and screw it into there to hold it on. Ours, uh, as you can see here, does not have that flat surface, that flat opening. So what we're gonna do, and you can do this on yours if, if yours is designed this way, is we're just going to attach this down here at the bottom, and then we're gonna drill, our, drill ourselves a little pilot hole right here and uh, use the provided screws that come with our mud guards to put it on in the top, and it'll work perfectly that way. So let's get this thing on the truck. So what we're doing here basically is we're taking our screws that came with the factory, well they were factory screws on the truck, and we're reinstalling those through the holes that we drilled into our mud guard. And then once we have these in, then we're going to be able to go ahead and drill this top one. Now that we have our hole drilled out and we have our, our screw started, we have our bottom ones attached, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go ahead and run this, this top screw in, and then we're gonna tighten everything up, and uh, that'll be pretty much it for how to install our mud guard. So let's get this tightened up. Okay guys, there you go. That's how easy it is to put these onto your truck. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and finish this up, we'll do the other side, and it attaches exactly the same way as we did this side. And we're going to go ahead and show you guys how to put the rear ones on. Now we've got our front mud guards on our truck. So at this point, we're ready to put our, our rear ones on. So the first thing we're going to do on here is, to, is determine how high our mud guard is going to come up on our, on our fender here. And I've already done that. It's just simply hold it up on here, see where the top of it hits. So we know that we need to drill out this spot. Now, one of the really cool things about this is, is that these things come with, from the factory with these indents already. Uh, and that's for some different reasons. For Some of them have chrome, stuff like that. But we're going to use this for our mud guard. So we're going to go ahead and drill this out. And then I'm going to show you how to, to install that clip and such on here so that we can put a screw in here to hold our mud guard on. So let's get this drilled. Now we've got our hole drilled. So the next thing we need to do here is install our clip. Now keep in mind that this can go on both directions. However, if you look at the back of it here, you can kind of see how it's raised up a little bit. That's going to be the back side. The flat side is going to be our front. So we're going to put it on here like so. Now that we've got our factory screws removed from the lower section down here, we've got our clip in place. 
The next thing we want to do here is get our mud guard and uh, hold it up on here and determine where we're going to drill our hole and the top part so we can attach the top. Once we get that done, then we'll be able to line up our bottom and drill our holes for that. What we want to do is we want to put this screw here, you know, as close to the top as possible. Maybe a half an inch down on here is where we're going to want to put our screw and we're going to want to set this so that it's the same distance as the front. Otherwise it'll look kind of silly going down the road. You got one out further than the other. So we know that the front is one and three eighths because I've already measured that. So the next thing we need to know is how far in this is. And that is seven eighths of an inch in. So that we're going to add that to our inch and three eighths that we need out. And that's going to tell us where we need to put our hole in our mud guard to attach it here. So I'm going to go mark this off drill it and then bring it back here and attach it. We've got our, our holes drilled out in our mud guard and we've got our clip in place. Now we're ready to go ahead and install this into the truck. So let's get it on there so you guys can see what this thing looks like. Once we've got our, all of our screws started in here, I went ahead and tightened up this top one just to hold everything in place. But, and uh, we can go ahead at this point and tighten up our bottom ones and get those all snug down. There you go guys. That's how quick, simple, and easy it is to install these Husky Liner Universal Fit molded mud flaps onto your truck. So remember, until next time, happy motoring.